video I want to try to uh, build a truss uh, I want to try to build a, a truss for uh, this uh, freeform surface uh, inside uh, uh, a building um, this operation uh, is uh, composed by uh, a truss and a paneling of the surface uh, I, for, uh, for this operation I will use uh, uh, Rhino and a plugin called uh, uh, Weaver Beard that work uh, on uh, that work with uh, the topology of the mesh. Uh, in fact, I want to start uh, from a tessellation uh, because if I want to panel in this uh, surface, I have to, uh, of this surface of this freeform surface, I have to paneling. Uh, in uh, uh, I have to paneling, I have to create a, a tessellation uh, of uh, the uh, surface. Uh, I want to switch off uh, the <coughs> the building, so I only the surface inside my my screen. Uh, the first thing I have to do is to create the topology of the mesh that I want to use to. Uh, tessellate uh, the surface. I have it inside uh, the mesh start layer. Uh, this uh, mesh is possible to build and is possible to decide the number of faces uh, along the uh, x axis and uh, y axis uh, with uh, a special tool inside the mesh tools. Uh, this tool is uh, uh, mesh Plane. In mesh plane, you can decide the x faces uh, and the y faces. Okay, 20 uh, for this for this surface, 20 uh, along the y direction and uh, 10 along the x uh, direction. Uh, now I have to uh, flow this mesh along this surface. Uh, if uh, uh, there is a, a tool in a transform. There is a tool in transform, in transform that allow me to flow uh, every uh, thing of uh, everything, everything uh, of uh, every object uh, from uh, a NARBS surface to another NARBS surface. But in this case. I have only a mesh and I have to uh, move this uh, mesh uh, along uh, uh, this uh, surface. So uh, if I uh, go into the mesh tools, I can find uh, this uh, uh, another tools very interesting that is called apply mesh to an app surface. With this one, I can uh, do something similar to flow along the uh, surface, but with the uh, mesh and uh, without uh, another uh, base uh, nubs, uh, uh, for example, under this uh, uh, mesh. So uh, I press with the left button of the mouse uh, and he uh, set polygon mesh to apply. Mm, this one is, is uh, the mesh. I click here and uh, select target surface. Uh, I can uh, uh, press uh, in a, a corner uh, similar to the, car to the corner of the mesh here. And uh, as you can see now, uh, uh, the mesh is along uh, the NARPS surface. So in this space, I can find uh, uh, mesh and surface together. I can uh, switch off the, uh, the NARPS uh, visibility, hide objects. OK. Now I have only <coughs> only um, the mesh with a, a shape similar to the NARBS uh, uh, shape. Um, uh, uh, mesh is uh, the mesh is important because I have face 
and age. The ages uh, could be a structure of the uh, cover and the, fa the, uh, the faces could be the panel of the uh, cover. But I have to um, uh, divide, I have to duplicate, for example, the ages uh, and uh, I will use this, uh, uh, the, the, the edges to create a truss and the face to create the panels of the uh, cover, cover. Now <coughs> I want to switch off this part. Switch off uh, this uh, visibility. Hide objects. Perfect. Uh, when, uh, if you want to uh, manipulate uh, or change or transform or obtain uh, data from uh, a mesh, uh, um, a special plugin is uh, uh, Weaver Beard. In Weaver Beard, uh, you have uh, the, uh, uh, the most important uh, tools to manipulate the topology of. Uh, a mesh, for example, I can uh, uh, extract uh, mesh edges lines from a surface, a mesh surface. Uh, but uh, inside, you can find uh, uh, tools to extract mesh, uh, extract faces, and extract uh, vertices. Vertices. Uh, perfect. <coughs> so. I can use uh, uh, extract mesh edges to obtain all the line around the faces. Mm -hmm. I want to create another layer called uh, uh, CRV <coughs> line line. Okay in uh, blue blue perfect now i want to extract the lines the edges from the mesh and use it like a, um, a, a rail to create the the structure uh, below the skin of the uh, mesh surface. Uh, to do it, uh, I have to use a tool inside the uh, Weaver Beard. Uh, here I can find uh, I can find extract mesh edges. Uh, extract mesh edges uh, working this way. Uh, press the tool and uh, uh, it saved me it saves me to uh, <coughs> set the mesh to extract the edges this one is the mesh enter and I obtain all the edges but, but the mesh um, <coughs> disappears so I have to undo and uh, uh, do uh, it again but change um, any parameters <coughs> so here replace no okay with replace no uh, i will obtain the ages and uh, uh, don't uh, uh, the, the, the mesh don't, uh, doesn't disappear. Okay, so I select the mesh, enter. Now I have the mesh and the edges of every mesh, every face. Okay, <laughs> now I can switch off the mesh and uh, I can work with uh, the I can work with the lines to create the truss uh, under the, the, the mesh. Uh, the goal is to create uh, a truss in a short time. Uh, 
So now I want to uh, extrude the uh, normal to the C plane every line with the height of the tr truss that I want to obtain. Okay. So uh, I can do this uh, operation. Uh, I want to create another layer, a construction layer. So uh, uh, so face face perfect in red okay and I can extrude all these lines uh, surface tools I want to extrude it with uh, uh, extrude straight on this line. Okay, uh, perfect. Uh, I can decide uh, a number, uh, for example, uh, um, uh, one point five uh, meters. Okay, but not uh, uh, up, but down. So, control Z. I will do it again. Okay. Uh, okay, a negative number, not uh, 1.5, but uh, 1. Enter. Perfect. Perfect. As you can see here, the color uh, um, of the layer is uh, wrong, so I can select all the surfaces and change the, and I can change uh, the layer, change object layer, perfect. So I can switch off the, la the layer of the lines, and I can work with the, the the last layer uh, from uh, from this all this surface as you can see there are a lot of knob, knobs surface but of these uh, surfaces I want only the uh, contours the contours okay From all these knobs uh, surfaces, I want to extract uh, the contours uh, and uh, 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 another line that is the, the diagonal of the uh, surface. But uh, remember, I want to do it in a, in a very short time. Uh, to do it, I have to uh, transform the knob surfaces in a mesh. Uh, in the specific, I have to uh, create uh, uh, triangular meshes. Okay, so <coughs> uh, as you can see, uh, every one uh, of uh, this uh, uh, surface uh, every surface is uh, composed by uh, Face and one, two, three, four uh, um, control points. Uh, for example, I can uh, uh, duplicate this one, <coughs> and uh, I can see the ISO curves. And uh, if I switch on the points, uh, the control points uh, here, I can see one, two, three, four uh, control. Uh, points. The surface, uh, the degree of the surface is uh, 1 and for uh, every edge uh, th th there are uh, two, two uh, control points. I can create a mesh from uh, the control points of a surface here. Here in uh, Mesh Tools I can uh, create um, 
the <coughs> the mesh from these tools this uh, tool is a very interesting tool because I can extract mesh from NARPS control polygon okay so I click it set surface uh, curves to extract control polygon uh, here enter and as you can see I obtain a surface and a mesh I can do and then after this I can uh, change the topology of the mesh from a quad mesh to a triangular mesh triangulate mesh so I can obtain uh, this and at the end I will extract the edges of the uh, mesh to create the part part of the truss okay now I can do it for all all uh, the surfaces that uh, are uh, here okay so I will do it again but for all the surfaces extract mesh from now this control polygon set curves or surface to extract uh, the mesh okay enter and now I have the mesh okay uh, and create another layer and as each mesh uh, truss okay perfect and I will change object layer perfect I can reach off uh, the surface and I adjust the meshes every part of uh, the uh, of this uh, <coughs> object is only a mesh with a singular uh, face but I said that I have to uh, create uh, I have to change the topology of every face and so I uh, triangulate the faces all the faces perfect as you can see I have a, a triangle and from this triangle I can obtain the lines useful to create the truss perfect again um, again I have to use uh, uh, wheel beard but remember every time you have to create a layer uh, line underscore plus perfect and with wheel beard I can extract my shades in as you can see perfect but it's not black but uh, don't worry because I can select uh, the meshes and which of it perfect and I can I can put the lines inside the right uh, layer perfect but remember that uh, this line is not only a line but there are a lot of lines because here in this line uh, uh, there was uh, 
three border of uh, surface. Okay, but in Rhino you can select here, select, select, set duplicate, duplicate objects, and I can press it, and uh, as you can see, in yellow, uh, there are the duplicate, and if I uh, press Cunch, Dell, uh, it leaves only one uh, line, perfect. Now, uh, I have the base uh, to create <coughs> pipe, useful for a truss. So, I have to decide the dimension of the uh, pipe. I want to try to create a circle uh, here to understand the dimension. Uh, for example, um, this radius, uh, this radius could be good point zero five meters. Perfect. I can create a multiple pipe uh, uh, around every line. Uh, so. Here, uh, another layer that I will call <coughs> 3D truth truss mm -hmm. and in solid tools I will create a, a, round, a pipe with round cups but I have to press multiple multiple okay multiple set cars to create pipes around all these cars enter and pipe radius pipe radius i say the point uh, zero five but uh, i think is the best uh, the number the best number is uh, point zero four Okay, now I can see the truss. Okay, I have to change the layer of this uh, structure. It's very interesting. It's very, very interesting. And uh, I have to select the solid object and here here set closed polysurfaces perfect and change object layer I want to switch off the line inside because if, if I uh, switch in wireframe view I can see that inside there are uh, lines Okay, now there are lines, but only the truss make with pipe. Shade it perfect, perfect. Now uh, I have to switch on the original mesh because I want to create the panels. The panels. But the best thing is to mm, create a group of all these uh, elements. So here, group all these parts. Perfect. So when I click here, I will select all the uh, truss. Well, mesh start is uh, this one but uh, I don't like that the mesh is uh, inside the uh, upper 
pipes so I have to move down the truss for example I have to create a distance useful to fill uh, it with uh, 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 a, a structure for, for the paneling so I, I have to go uh, down point three for example perfect uh, I want to see this uh, truss inside the uh, uh, building building okay and uh, it's uh, perfect but uh, for example here I have to extend uh, this uh, pipe to connect uh, with this part of the building okay but uh, I can do this <coughs> operation in a second time now I want to create panels but not uh, quad panels panel because uh, uh, for example uh, this part is not uh, a planar surface but uh, I am sure that this part is a, a curved surface only with a triangle only with a triangle I, I, I can create a planar surface but uh, uh, as I said uh, uh, before I can transform, I can change a quad mesh in a triangular mesh so I switch up the building I switch up the 3D, 3D truss and I can change a quad mesh in a triangular mesh Triangular mesh, uh, mesh tools, okay, triangulate mesh. Perfect. But as you can see, the direction of the diagonal is uh, could be different in, uh, uh, in the different. Uh, it, it depends uh, uh, from uh, the distance, uh, for example the path that the computer uh, uh, choose is the um, less uh, uh, the minor distance between two points but uh, I can change this with this one a swap mesh changes okay so I can create the same direction okay For example, uh, I don't know if this one is the correct direction. Yes, can do it uh, uh, in a short time if it's possible. Oops. Obviously, with a uh, grasshopper, this operation is uh, uh, very short, but uh, I like to do this uh, uh, operation only in Rhino and uh, uh, just adding a plugin with a beard. Okay, I can work from the top view uh, okay perfect are in the same uh, direction that is uh, uh, good
good for, for uh, the, the shape and now I can uh, uh, split the mesh in every faces and collect the dimension of every panel ok, uh, this is uh, the, the end of this uh, tutorial uh, next time I want to create the frame of every panel and connect it with the truss uh, thanks uh, at all, bye